3Code has Instant Meshes plugin installed. You can access it through going to Auto and going into Instant Meshes Manual and Instant Meshes Auto. So Instant Meshes is a free retopology um, software and it's quite good. So it's not as good as uh, 3D code or to retopology tool, but it gives you a result quite nicely and pretty steadily and quite fast. So one thing that 3D code has done that improved instant meshes a lot, like in the instant meshes, you actually don't have a symmetry and you, go, you get a non-symmetrical model when you get output out of it. However, in 3D code, uh, they will automatically kind of weld the symmetrical part of the model to the other side and you get a fully symmetrical topology without any tweaking of it. 3D color topology is better when it comes, for example, for these shapes. It can actually identify it to be a circle and make a cylindrical topology. But again, as I was saying, uh, it takes a bit more time to set up a 3D color topology uh, like play around with settings and such to get the best result. If you want to do something really quick, I would normally recommend instant meshes. Let's go and do a manual or topology. So it will open the instant meshes plugin and I'll put the desired quantity at 10,000. So let's do that. And you can see here, you can actually see how 3D code achieves the symmetrical model inside of it. It's essentially just cutting everything else out and you're left over with the a cutout. While I set 10,000 desired poly count, now it's set at 5k just because, you know, when it gets symmetrical, it will double. You can also here uh, change the count by yourself and it will, you know, update. So when, once you've done that, you need then to go and click solve and it will give you the idea of how it's going to be solved. Uh, a direction of the edge loops. You can use this grooming brush to draw some lines, uh, trying to improve uh, the way it's going to be solved. But this is, again, this is where I would say then it's, if you want to do a lot of stuff using the instant meshes, it's actually better to use 3D code retopology tool. So then you, want, you need to click on the other solve as we'll then create the mesh so we can check it here. And then if I click export mesh, I need to click, uh, say, pure quad draw, quad mesh if I want that. And you can actually subdivide the mesh if you want. And then extract the mesh. And then click save. And it will get committed to 3D code. So we jump to 3D code and you can see here, we got a bit of a denser mesh uh, because I clicked on subdivide. And a better topology around the wheel. It's kind of trying to make it a circle. Uh, now, once I've drawn that uh, comb around it. And th these are the basics of those uh, Instant Meshes plugin. You don't really need to dig too much into it normally. And to get a quick, a good quad mesh out of it is really easy. Just one click inside 3D code.